I've got sound. Hello, it's Josh Gaming here, and welcome back to another video on AI career on MotoGP 17. On MotoGP 17, uh, if that's how I pronounce it. And today we're going to be carrying on through the fourth round now of AI career on the four stroke series. This is episode 24, we're on round number four, which is at Silverstone. We're at Silverstone this week. Uh, well, technically, it is my uh, my home race, uh, but um, it's actually, uh, well, it's actually Casey Stoner's. Um, well, it's technically going to be me, but it's just my home race. But I'm Casey Stoner, by the way. I'm not my own rider for this uh, race. Basically, uh, I'm Casey Stoner because he's from uh, Australia, of, of course. But this is round number four of AR Career on episode number 24. And so we're going to be carrying on through at this uh, race on the four strokes. And and depending if you don't know what I do in AR Career, I've got, try, I've got to try and get uh, five riders in the top positions without failing. So number one is Valentino Rossi. Number two is Don Pedrosa. Number three is, uh, is Lois Caparossi. Number four is Tony Elias. I, I was supposed to say Nicky Hayden for second, not Danny Pedroza. He's my old rider, uh, my old rival. And Nicky Hayden second. Um, and that's the way how, how it's going to work in the four stroke series. If you want to come check out uh, last season's MotoGP uh, when I did the, uh, the MotoGP category, I'll leave that in the description down below if you're actually not checking that out. Uh, because this is the, uh, the new AR career I started a couple of weeks ago. Basically, I've done it for like three um, weeks now. But yeah, this is round number four. And this time, we're on at Silverstone. It's going to be an interesting circuit, this one, because Silverstone's quite a hard track. So hopefully, hopefully that Tony Ellis is not going to be uh, low down this time because I'm getting a little bit, a little bit worried. But let's go and see actually how well it's going to go. And at the moment, though, the championship is looking pretty good. But the rider we need to focus on is Marco Melandre at the moment because he's in fifth. So right here we go. So Hayden and Rossi are in second and third. That's good. Capros in sixth, and Ellis is in ninth. So that's a, that, that's a good start for all my riders, and I'm in 12th. And I want to let you know, by the way, that this is my final time starting from 12th. And that in the next race, I am starting from the back of the grid, just to make it a little bit more challenging. Uh, so uh, so the guy we need to focus on at the moment is Marco Melandre at the moment, because he's in 5th in the championship. And, and uh, I'm, I think he's about 2 points behind me at the moment. So yeah, that's the guy that we need to focus on at the moment. So hopefully, we're going to be okay with him for today. But yeah, let's go see how it goes. Right. Right, so where is Tony Ellis? He should be ahead of me then. So uh, try and get uh, Shane Byrne out of the way. He's on the way uh, at the moment. Oh, it's Jeremy McWilliams, I suppose to say. McWilliams, or whatever, whatever his name is. Okay, right, we've just got McWilliams. Right, so Tony Elias, I believe, is just ahead. I think that might be Caparossi, actually. I think Caparossi is quite far down. Right, M M McWilliams, get out of the way, please. Thank you. Right, right, let's try and get to the front, and then we'll try and sort out the uh, the rest of the riders. So, I can actually see Caparossi already, so I believe that might be Tony Elias right there, uh, that Shane Byrne is trying to attack Jim, Jim McWilliams' McCle teammate. So, I think that might be him right there. Is it, yeah, that is him. So, it looks like... Oh! Oh, God! Oh, Jesus! I almost nearly got Tony Elias down. I almost nearly got him down. Right, right that, that's what I don't want to do. Oh, God! Went a little bit too deep into there. Right, I want to try and get uh, one of them down. Right, there we go. Right, get Shane Byrne. There we go. Right, he's down. That's good news. Right, that's going to give McWilliams a good spot. But, but Tony Elias, though, he's actually going down the pack, which is not good. But I'll I'll, I'll sort him out uh, in a little bit. And there is Caparossi as well. So he's in eighth at the at the moment. So he's not he's not had a bad start. So I think that might be uh, might be Dovi. I think that might be Dovi just ahead of him. So uh, that's uh, that's okay. I think it's either Dovi or one of the other one of the other Hondas. Uh, yes, it is Dovi. Dovi's just ahead of him. And also, I think is that Hayden? Oh, that's Biaggi. And BR just is just ahead of him as well. So I, can't, I can't really tell by these uh, by these by these sort of Hondas, but yeah, that's that's BRG ahead of him. So I believe that Nicky Hayden might be in second place already. And uh, there's Marco Melandre. Uh, so that's the guy we need to focus on uh, on today. So we need to try and uh, take down uh, Marco Melandre as much as we can because we need him to get out of fifth place at the at the moment because he's only two points behind me at the at the moment. So we need to try and get uh, uh, as many points off of him as we can. But I'm going to leave them for now. There's Danny Pedroza as well. So I'm going to leave them guys for now. So I'm going to try and focus on the front pack. So only the guy we need to get rid of is just Lorenzo. That's only the guy we just need to get rid of. Because Hayden and Rossi are, are already in second and third. So we can just leave them to it, basically. We can just leave them to it. So they can basically either finish whatever points they are. So it doesn't actually really matter. Just because that uh, just because that Rossi's got a, a big lead in the championship. So that's, that's okay at the moment. So if, if, if we can just focus on Lorenzo and just leave them to, to it, uh, we'll be, uh, we'll be alright. So... Let's try and get Lorenzo out of the way, and then, and then we'll and then we'll be okay. Now the Caparossi should be in about fifth. Right, let's try and get Lorenzo out of the way. He's going to be in the way at the moment. Right, Lorenzo, get out of the way. Thank you. Right, Lorenzo's out of the way. That's good. Right, so where is Caparossi? So he's he's right there at the moment. Uh, so I'm going to now go after Marco Melandri now. So I can see Caparossi in the distance. So it looks like Lorenzo is still ahead of him at the moment. That is not good news. So I will have to, I'll, I will have to go and get Lorenzo down. But first, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to go and focus on these guys. 
um, at the moment. Just, the, uh, these guys just ahead of Lorenzo. Because uh, I don't want these guys catching uh, Nicky Hayden. So I'm just going to just go and get Melandre and Pedroza down. The good news is though is we need to get Marco Melandre down. Because we, we need to try and get, uh, get him as many points off of him as we can. I'm going to try and get uh, Marco Melandre uh, actually not any points whatsoever. Uh, it's basically he don't actually finish in the top, uh, in the top 10. So uh, that'll, that'll be a really good idea. If we can try and do that if we can. And one let you know that I am using Casey Stoner for this series on the on the 2007 Ducati. If, if you might have wondered by the, by the design. And we're at Silverstone. It looks like it's a bright sunny day. And we've got 10 laps to do the sensor. Hopefully we're going to be okay. Right, let's get the let's get these guys down. There we go. Right, there's one. There's Pedroza. Right, let's get let's get Marco Melandre. There we go. Oh, oh, oh no, we haven't. We haven't got him down yet. Right, Marco Melandre, get down, please. Alright, come on, get down. Get down. There we go. Right, he's down, there we go. Right, Marco Melandre is down. Right, so just just need to get Lorenzo again. And then uh, I think Caparossi might be... Oh, oh my god, I think there's like three of them attacking him. Oh, that's not good. There's actually three of, him, uh, three of them that are actually attacking him at the moment. So I just need to get Biaggi and Lorenzo now. And then, and then he'll be he'll be right there. Yeah, oh my god, oh my god, he has. He's actually got attacked as well by two Hondas as well. That That's not good at the moment. Right, I need to get Lorenzo down. Lorenzo, get down. Oh, for God's sake. Right, Lorenzo, get down. Oh, 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 oh my god, oh my, oh my, the fuck, Jesus, I think I'm flipping at the barrier, well that was not good, I'm flipping at the barrier, well that's not good, oh my god, Jesus Christ, I'm going down on place at the moment, yeah, um, I'm flipping at the barrier there, Jesus Christ, I'm flipping at the barrier, well that, well that was not good, that has now put me down loads of places, right, I'll have to do that all again, well that was not good, I'm flipping... I think that's the first ever time I've actually hit that barrier on the final corner. Because I've actually never done that before. So that's the first ever time I've done that. Well, to be fair, though, I've been around that corner so many times, and that's the first time I've done that. So I won't be doing that ever again. Because that, that bloody made me shocked. <laughs> that bloody made me shocked, that. Let's, uh, let's get my Landry down again, just because I don't want to get him any points. Right, let's get my Landry. Get him. Oh, God, Jesus Christ. Right, let's get my Landry. Right. Oh, oh, my God, Jesus Christ. This is not working. Right. Oh, God. Jesus. This is not working at the moment. Right, let's get both of the uh, the Hondas out of the way. That's fine. Right, let's get let, right, let's get Melandre, because he's, uh, he's getting in the way at the moment. Right, come on, Melandre. Out of the way. Come on. There we go. Right, he's out of the way. Right, that should be at Caparossi. But Caparossi, he's getting really attacked at the moment. I'm, a, I'm actually struggling. I, I, I'm only on lap number three, and I'm really struggling. But where's Tony Elias? I'm getting a little bit worried about him as well. Oh, God. I'm going on the curves. Uh, let's try and get Caparossi very, very cleanly. Come on, out of the way. Thank you. Right, so we've got uh, Dove, Bedroza. We've got like three Hondas ahead of him. That's not really, really good. Right, let's get Dove. Right, see you later, Dove. Right, there we go. That's Dove down. Right, next up is Bedroza. Oh, God. I've missed him. I missed him. Just go wide. Why don't you about getting bloody missed him? <laughs> right, that's not where we need to get Bedroza. Right, I should get him. I'm going to get him into this corner. Right, let's get him into here. Come on. Yes, there we go. Right, that's him down. Right, there we go. So, Kafrossi is safe. Going to get Biagi as well in swoop. Yes, we do. Right, so that Kafrossi is now in... He's in fifth. So, we just need to get one more guy. Oh, God, I've gone a bit wide. So, we just need to get one more guy. So, there's someone in third at the moment. And who is that in third? Yep, Rossi and Hayden are battling. That's That's fine. So there's, like, there's someone in third. So I don't I don't know who that is at the moment. I, ho I, ho I hope it's not... I don't think it's Melandre. It's Lorenzo. Lorenzo! What the hell are you doing there? You're not supposed to be like Lorenzo. Right, Lorenzo's in third. Right, we, right, we need to get him down. Right, let's go and catch him up then. Let's go, and, let's go and get him. Let's go and get Lorenzo. He's not supposed to be there. Right, let's go and, uh, let's go and get him. Let's go and get the old man in charge, Lorenzo, on his Yamaha. Right, off we go. Oh my god, that is a big gap as well. That is quite a big gap. It's always that like the, the, the Lorenzo. Uh, Lorenzo's going to catch him up here, I think. I, I, I don't know. I don't know how far Lorenzo's down on them. Hopefully, hopefully he's not too far down on them. So I'm getting a little bit worried about that. Hopefully he's not too far down. Yeah, he's, he's catching them up, isn't he? He's catching them up. That's that's not what we want to do. Right, I'm almost nearly on him now. Right, I might be able to get him into this corner. Come on. Come on, Casey Stoner. Right, I might be able to get him into here. Is it going to work? Yes, it is. There we go. Right, I think he, he might be still in fourth, I think. I might have to get him down again, because Caparossi is quite far down into 
Yeah, he's right there. I can see him. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go and get him down again, just because he's actually in. He's in third. There we go. Right, just get him away. There we go. Right, fortunately, I will have to. Oh god, I've gone wide. I will have to get him down again. Right, let's get him into here. Right, come on. Let's get him down. Right, Lorenzo, get down. There we go. Right, there we go. Right, let's get Caprossi through. There we go. Right, Caprossi's through. There we go. Right, he's in third. There we go. Right, Caprossi is through and he's into third. Right, we just need to back these guys up now. It looks like we've got uh, we've got two Hondas just ahead of us. We've got um Cow uh, we've got um Barros and um Akawa in uh, in these positions. So and uh, that and I can see Pedroza as well. Pedroza's just behind them as well. So I'm gonna go and uh, just hunt for Pedroza. I don't, I don't want him getting uh, Caprossi. Right, I'm just gonna just go and get myself Danny Pedroza. There we go. Just get Pedroza. There we go. And uh, and there's, Loren there's Lorenzo again. All right, get Lorenzo down again. Right, what I'm, what I'm going to go and do is I might go and leave the other two Hondas because I don't think they're going to catch him up anyway. So I might, what I might do is I might leave the two Hondas. So I don't think they're going to catch him up, so I might leave them too. All right, let's get Lorenzo again. All right, Lorenzo, get out of the way. What are you doing with your life, Lorenzo? There we go. Right, he's down again. And there's Dovi as well. That's good news. There's, uh, there's Dovi as well, so that's very good news. Right, I'm going to go and hunt for the charge on the Hondas now. Because they're, they're actually getting away. Lorenzo, oh my god, Lorenzo's in 20th. Oh, that's good news. Lorenzo's down in 20th. That's really, really good. Lorenzo's down in 20th. That is, that is really, really good. And he's trying to find out where Marco Melandri is as well. Uh, hopefully, he's not, hopefully he's not in the points. Because if he's not in the points, that is really, really good. Because when he's trying to get Melandri as worst points as we can here. Right, I'm just going to just try and slow down uh, the Hondas. Right, let's go and slow down the Hondas. Right, right that's, uh, that's Toro Kawa slowed down a little bit. Looks like that Barros has uh, made his way through. That's what we don't want to Barros to do. Right, let's just get Toro Kara just a little bit wide. Right, I'm just going to just get him wide. That's fine. There we go. Right, he's wide. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Right, I'm going to just try and get uh, Barros. Because Barros has pulled away. Look at Barros. Look at him go. He's catching Caparossi. He's catching his old rival. Like I said in the past, they used to be teammates. Don't forget, Barros and Caparossi used to be teammates, didn't they? In the, in the past. Well, they're not anymore, but um, they used to be teammates. Right, Barros, sadly, I need to get you wide because I need to get Caprossi a bit of a breathing space. Right, I'm not going to get him down. I'm just going to just get him a bit of a breathing space. Right, here we go. That's perfect. There we go. That's fine. That's absolutely perfect. Right, I've got a little bit wide. I think that's fine. Right, I might be able to get him again. Uh, just get him a little bit more wide. Right, just slow him down a bit. Wants a bit of a battle, doesn't he? Right, I'll slow him down one more time. And, 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 and then I'm going to go and try, and try and find where Tony Elias is. Because if he's really far down again, that's not good. So what I'll go and do is I will go and add myself really wide in a minute. Right, I think that's they've got that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Right, let's go and uh, right, right then. Let's just let's just go wide here, and let's try and find where uh, let's try and find where, uh, where Tony Elias is. Because hopefully he's not far down. Right, let's try and um, try and go really far. Okay, right, that should be fine. There we go. Right, that that should be fine. Right, we're back in 21st. Okay, right, we're nearly at the back of the grid. That's absolutely fine. Right, Hop Hopkins is quite far down in this race. Ooh. Oh, oh my god, I almost nearly hit the barrier again. That would have been the second time I nearly did it then. That was so, so close. Right, let's get Makoko Tamada. There we go, that's fine. Right, on the hunt for Tony Elias. Right, where the hell is he at the moment? Hopefully he's in the point. Right, oh, I can see Lorenzo. Lorenzo's in 16th at the moment, so he's only one place away. So that's fine at the moment. There's Nakano and Troy Bayless. There's Caparossi's teammate. Trying to get around the outside of these guys. There we go, that's fine. And we've only got four laps left to try and get Tony Elias in, into the points. There's, a, there's his teammate. There's, a, there's Tony Elias' teammate. And Lorenzo is now in 15th. So he's just took over Colin Edwards in 16th. So Tony Elias must be ahead of these guys then. And, uh, oh, there he is. He's right there. There's Tony Elias. He's right there. Let's get his teammate. Let's get his teammate. There he is. I, can, I, think, I, think, I think that might be him right there. So I think he's in 13th. So that's not too bad. So I don't want, I don't want Lorenzo getting him. Yeah, yeah, Lorenzo's on him, Lorenzo. Lorenzo's on him. Right, let's go and get let's go and get Colin Edwards. Oh god, I've gone wide. Sorry, Colin Edwards. Right, right, let's get Colin Edwards. There we go. That's fine. There he is. You're in 15th, Tony Elias. What are you doing there, mate? Right, Tony Elias is in 15th. That's that's not bad. That's actually not bad. Right, Lorenzo, you stupid guy. Lorenzo, get off. Get off me. Get off, Lorenzo. There we go. <laughs> Just pushed him wide. That's fine. There we go. Right, let's give Tony Elias a place. There we go. So he's in He's in 15th. So that's, that's not good for him at the moment. That's not really, really good. So I need, I need to work hard on these last couple of laps. Right. Oh, oh, oh there's Marco Melandri. That's good. There's Melandri. So he's in 13th place. That's good. Right, I might be able to get uh, him down here. Because I want to try and get him uh, not any points. So I'm going to try and get him into here. Which is going to be uh, which is going to be good. 
Right, I might be able to get my Landry into here. Let's get him into here. Ooh, there we go, that's fine. Right, I've got my Landry, that's good. Right, next up is Neil Hodson and Danny Pedroza. Right, I'm going to try and get these guys. Right, get him. There we go, get Neil Hodson. There we go, sorry Hodson. Unfortunately, we'll have to get you down. Get Pedroza. That's fine. There we go. Right, Tony Elias. Oh, God. Almost another crushed him up. Right, Elias. Oh, my God. He's getting attacked again. Oh, my God. He's getting attacked. Okay. Right, he's getting attacked here. Oh, God. Right, who's attacking him? It's Melandre. Melandre. You're attacking him. Oh, my God. Look at Bayless. He's doing really, really well. Right. Oh, my God. Right, Melandre's got him. That's not good. Right, right Melandre's got him. Right, I'll have to get Melandre down again. Right, Marco Melandre. Get, get yourself down again. Oh, God. I don't want to knock Elias down. Let's get him down very cleanly. Oh, God. There we go. Right, let's get Melandre. There we go. There we go. He's down. There we go. That's fine. Oh, God. I've gone a bit wide. Oh, sorry, Troy Bayless. Right, here we go. Right, he's now... He's in 11th. That's good. Right, let's try and get him very cleanly. There we go. Bye-bye, Tony Elias. I'll see you in a minute. There we go. So, he's, uh, he's back in 11th. That's good. Right, hopefully he's not going to get attacked anymore. I think Troy Bayless might have a go, but... uh. Apart from that, though, he should be fine for now. So let's let, let's go and catch the, the next group. Because he's, uh, he's quite far behind on these guys at the moment. So that's, that's actually not too bad. But at the moment, though, I did say that this might be a bit of a struggled one. Because it is my home race. So uh, I did say it might be a, a bit of a struggled one. But um, apart from that, though, it's absolutely fine. Next up is Jeremy McWilliams. Right. Let's try and get round the outside. Uh, come on, McWilliams. You need to get down. Uh, he's either going to get down or he's, uh, he's going to bloody slow down. Come on, Milan. Come on, McWilliams. Ooh, come on. Yes, there we go. He's fine. Right, there we go. That's fine. Right, on to the next group. I believe that McWilliams might be ahead of him, but I'm going to leave Tony Elias for now. Right, because we've still got we've still got three laps left to go, so I've still got plenty of time. Right, let's get let's get Roberts. There we go. That's fine. There we go. Right, Roberts is down. Right, next up is Alex Hoffman. Right, I'm going to get this guy, and I'm going to, I'm going to try and see how Caparossi is getting on, because I don't want them two Hondas getting him. Right, I'm going to try and get back to the front. I'm going to go and see how Caparossi is getting on. There's a, there's Dovi and uh, Biagi. So that's good news. Right, hopefully Caparossi is not getting attacked. It looks, like, it looks like both of the Hondas are still where they are, but it looks like that they've, they've caught him a little bit. So I will have to go and slow them down a little bit more. Yeah, it looks like that the, the two Hondas have actually caught Caparossi up a little bit more, so we'll have to go and slow him down a bit. Right, let's go and slow him down a bit. Right, we might be able to do this in a bit bit of a clean, not clean sleep. I mean, a uh, clean sleep, uh, not clean sleep. Um, clean, yeah, clean sleep. I was supposed to say. Uh, right, here we go. Right, let's go and slow them down again. It looks like they've actually caught him up a little bit, which is not good. So I'll have to go and slow them. Oh, oh God, sorry, Barras. Well, I want to go and slow them down again. Oh, I don't want to get them down. I just want to. Uh, I just want to slow them down a bit. Let's get let's get Toro Car on the grass. That's fine. They've got he's he's on the grass. That's fine. Right, just going to get Barros as well. So these guys are going to slow down a little bit, which is fine. Right, here we go. Right, just going to get Barros slowed down. Right, I don't want to knock him down. I just want to slow him down. Ooh, off the curves. That's f oh god, a little bit too deep. Right, let's get him down. Ooh, right, let's go and slow him down. Ooh, right. Oh, I've crushed him anyway. Well, that is the Lacrosse affair to Barros. There we go, he's got down now. Right, let's go and slow Toro Kawa down. There we go. Right, slowing down. Oh, God, the Honda's coming through. Right, here we go, the Honda's are through. Right, I'm just going to get the Honda's down. And I'm going to go and focus on where uh, Kafros is. But, that, but there's actually a big gap, by the way, now. Which is uh, which is good news. Look at that gap, by the way, to, uh, to the Honda's. That's actually really, really good. Right, I'm just going to get Dovey. There we go. Right, I'm just going to just go wide into here. Right, here we go. Right, 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 let's go really, really wide. Right, where is Tony Elias? Hopefully, he's not getting attacked. Because, because remember, I, I need to finish behind Tony Elias, don't forget. Because I'm not allowed to finish. Is that him right there? I think that might be him right there. So there we go. I, I think he's actually still where he is. That's actually really, really good. There's Lorenzo again. There's Lorenzo. So he's in 14th. Bye-bye, Lorenzo. Bye-bye, Lorenzo. Bye-bye. <laughs> right, -bye. that's Lorenzo down again. That's good. Right, so Lorenzo is down. Uh, where is he at the moment, Lorenzo? Uh, he's in 17th, so he's only lost two places. That's not bad. Right, so Tony Elias is now just ahead of Pedroza. So that's good. Right, there's Bayless. Not going to bother about him. Right, Pedroza's right ahead of him, so I'm going to give him a bit of a breathing space. There we go. Right, there's Pedroza again. Right, so Elias is in, he's in 11th. So he's almost nearly in the top 10. That's really, really good. Right, so I, need, I just need to get the other guys. Right, just get him very cleanly. There we go. So Elias is doing really, really well now. He's in 12th. That's good. 
Right, so I just need to get uh, Roberts and... Is that Shane Byrne? That's McWilliams I need to get. So I just need to get these two. And then Elias will be in ninth. Yeah, I'll be in ninth. Oh, <laughs> Kenny Roberts. <laughs> what a nasty moment by Roberts. That's really, really good. Oh, God, gone wide. Oh, God, on the grass. Let me to do... Oh, God. Oh, no. No! Oh. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, no. He's down. I've got him. Right, that is the end of Tony Elias. And I've only got one more lap left to go. Right, sadly, Tony Elias will have to win this race. Oh, silly me. Oh, silly me. Well, what happened there is um, is uh, I collided into I collided into McWilliams. Um, and unfortunately, I collided into Elias and I knocked him down. Uh, I went on the grass a little bit onto that corner and I collided him and he fell over. Well, that is the end of Tony Elias for this race. So hopefully hopefully he's going to finish in the points. Because I think he's in about 16th. So hopefully he's going to finish with one point. But that is the end of Tony Elias, unfortunately. That is the end. I'm not going to bother getting him all the way up again. So that is the end of Tony Elias' defeat in this race. And oh, actually, Marco Melanger, I'm going to get him down, actually. Right, I'm going to go and get Marco Melanger again because he's a uh, yeah he's a, he's a I, I don't I don't want I don't want him finishing ahead of Tony Elias, which is not good. So I'm going to go and get him down again. Right, I'm going to go and get Marco Melanger again because I don't want him finishing ahead of him. Right, I can't see Elias on the map at the moment, so I'm going to go and leave him for now. Hopefully, he's going to get some points. Mel Melanger's only lost one place. You are joking. Right, I'll have to leave him because I'm not going to bother getting him down. So unfortunately, I think I think he will get some points, but he might not finish in the top 10 because that gap is quite big at the moment. And uh, Troy Bayless, he's doing really, really well at the moment. Caprossi's teammate, he's uh, he's doing really, really well. But I'm not really bothered about him because he's finished quite a lot anyway, so I'm not really bothered about him. Right, 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 then let's go and get back to third. Let's, let's go and get back to third in this final lap. Because like I said, though, I can't finish ahead of Tony Elias anyway. Well, I can. But the problem is, if he's really low down, I'm not going to really bother. Otherwise, I'm not going to get any points. So let's let's go and get back to third. Let's go and get back to third, and we're going to see what the championship's getting on. So I believe that why is it, oh yeah, Lorenzo's down in it. So where is why is Dobby? Is Dob is Dobby ahead of these guys? Oh god, get out of the way, Biagi. <laughs> get Biagi out of the way. Right. So where is Dobby? Is that is that Dobby right there? I think that might be Dobby right there. It is Dobby. Dobby's right there. So he's in seventh. So that's not bad. So I'm going to go and get him very cleanly. Right, let's go and get Dobby, because uh, he's not doing too bad in the championships. I'm going to I'm going to go and leave Dobby, just because I've got him down for a bit of a while. So I'm going to go and leave him. So we've just we've just got the two Hondas, haven't we? We've got we've got Barros and Toro Cara, haven't we? So uh, there's uh, there's Barros. So I believe that might be is that Toro Cara and someone else? I believe. Let's go and get myself back to fourth then. So I will be finishing in fourth for today. Right, so that is that's um, Hoffman and uh, Toro Cara. So it looks like that Capros has got a, a, a big gap. That's really good news. There we go. So it's Hoffman and Akawa who, who are battling for fifth. That's good news for Hoffman. At least Hoffman's going to get some points. That's going to be really, really good. Right, I'm, go I'm, I'm just going to just slow these guys down a little bit more just because that, I just because I don't really bother um, getting these guys down. So I'm going to go and slow him down a little bit. Right, I'm just going to just get Toro Akawa into here so I just slow him down a bit. Right, I'm just going to just slow him down a bit. That's fine. Uh, I'm not going to uh, uh, not going to bother uh, bother about Alex Hoffman so he can stay where he is. But there we go. Right, we're back to fourth, so we're going to we're going to be ending in fourth for today. Uh, I literally have no idea where Tony where Tony Elias is going to end up. Hopefully he's going to be in the points. And Marco Melandre, I'm getting a little bit worried about him. So hopefully he's going to finish in about 11th. Uh, there we go. Ross is one. So Hayden is in second. Capros is in third. I'm in fourth. And I don't know where Elias is, but let's go and see what happens at the, uh, at the end of the results. All right, into the final corner of Silverstone. Trying to try not catch Caparossi. There we go. I have a pretty slow exit. And, uh, and there we go. So that's actually not been a bad race, that one. Not been too bad. Into the final corner. And there we go. And there we go. That's that one done. That's round number four. And there we go. That was um that was not a bad one, actually. That was not too bad. Good news is that at least that Hoffman got some points. Right, here we go then. So let's go see the final results then. So Rossi won by just about, actually, 84 seconds he managed to win by Nicky Hayden. And Rossi were close to finish that win, but Rossi got the win. Hayden got second with 84 points. That's really, really good. So they both finished in first and second. Cap Rossi was 26 points behind in third. Uh, Casey Stone and myself were in fourth. I was two points, uh, I was two seconds behind at Cap Rossi. Uh, Hoffman is in fifth place. Tora Carlson in sixth. Barros is in seventh. Dobby's in eighth. McQuillian is in ninth. Biagi is in tenth. Troy Bayliss is in 11th, Edwards in 12th, Hodson in 13th. Right, hopefully Tony Lace is going gonna to end in the points. 
Uh, oh no, he ain't got any points. He ain't got any points. But Loren but Lorenzo. Oh yes, he's not got any points. That's good. So Lorenzo's not got any points. But where is? Where's Mark? Oh, I, I oh my God, Marco Melandri! Oh my God, Marco Melandri's not even got no points. Oh my God, that's good. That's gonna be good for the championship. Marco Melandri, he's in 19th. That's gonna be good. That's gonna that's gonna not give him any points. But Tony Elias. Oh no, 20th. Well, that's not good for Tony Elias. Oh my God, that is not good. That is not good for Tony Elias. And his teammate, he finished right at the back. That is, a, that is not good for Tony Elias. He was 43.1 seconds behind. Well, that is not good for Tony Elias. That is really going to put him down in the championship. But Marco Melandri, though, he's in 19th. So he, he, he just finished ahead of him. So that means that Tony Elias and Marco Melandri are not going to get any points in that race. So I might end up catching to Tony Elias by only about one point. So... Because, like I said, though, I'm not allowed to finish ahead of him. I've got to finish above him, by the way, in fifth place. So, yeah, that's what I've got to do. And Bedroza, he's in 17th. So that's good by him as well. So that's really, really good. So Bedroza, Marco Melange, Tony Lace, and Lorenzo did not get any points. That's really good. So only, only the guys that got points was Dove and Max Biaggi. That was only the two Hondas that got points. But Barros, he got 7th. That was good. Dove got 8th. McWilliams got 9th. Colin Edwards, he got 12th. Kenny Roberts got the last point in 15th. But yeah, that is a, that is, that's not bad. That is a, actually not bad. I'm pretty happy with that. With Troy Bayless, though, um, I'm glad that he's up in the board a little bit. He's got a he's, he's in 11th in the end. So it looks like he's going to get some points. But apart from that, though, that's not been a bad race, to be fair. I know I've been saying that Tony Elias has been having a few problems. But uh, apart from that, though, it's fine. But uh, there we go. So Tony Lace is had another another defeat in that race because he ended um, in another good race in Sepang, and unfortunately in Silverstone he's ended in 20th, which is not going to be good. But let's go and see what the championship is because I'm kind of a little bit worried about it at the moment. Uh, so let's go and see what the championship is going to be. But, but the front two are going to be okay. So let's go and see what it is. Right, let's go and see then. So Rossi is in the lead by 100 now. So he's doubled his lead again. And uh, Nicky Hayden, like I said, he's doubled his lead again in second with 80. So Rossi and Hayden have actually doubled their lead now in first and second because they've, they've doubled. Uh, Cap Rossi is still in third with 61. But you can kind of say that I've moved up now. I've moved up into fourth place. So, oh, oh, oh my God. That is, uh, that is, quite, that is quite a big gap. Okay, so my gap to Tony Lace is nine points. That is not good news. So, so, so definitely in the next race, if uh, Tony Liz does finish low down, I will have to finish in like 15th or whatever. But, uh, but I am, uh, but I'm now ahead of Tony Liz, which is not good. So I, I moved up to fourth. Uh, at least it's not moved down into fifth. But Biaggi, oh look at look at Biaggi though. Biaggi is three points behind. So. Oh my god, so there's actually three guys I need to focus on in the next race, which is Marco Malandre, Totoro Kawa, and Max Biaggi. They're the three guys I need to focus on. Max Biaggi, he's moved up into sixth now. That is a, that is not good, because he's only three points behind Tony Elias. That is not good by him. Toro Kawa is only one point behind Biaggi. And Marco Malandre, he's only two points behind Toro Kawa and three points behind Max Biaggi. So that is not good. Colin Edwards, though, he's in ninth, which is good. Danny Pedrosa, he's in tenth. That's good. Barros is in 11th, Hoffman in 12th, McWilliams in 13th, Roberts in 14th. Where's Lorenzo, by the way? Lorenzo? Lo Lorenzo's in 20th. That is really, really good. He's only got 7 points. That's really good by Lorenzo. Dobby's in 17th, which is uh, which is really re which is really good. Uh, yeah, that is, that is really good. That is really, really good, actually. So Lorenzo's in 20th, Dobby's in 17th. That's, uh, that's really, really good. That is absolutely brilliant. But to be fair, though... If, if Tony Elias has a bad race in the next one, I've got to finish above Tony Elias if it's either in 15th, 14th, if it's actually in the points. Because if I finish ahead of him again, I'm going to get that result and I'm going to finish in 4th anyway. But, I, but my, my target is 5th and not 4th. So that's what I've got to do in the next race. So that's what I've got to go and do in the next race. Just try and survive and try and get Tony Elias on the board a little bit. Because if, if he didn't have that crash, I would have, um, I would have, I would have got him. So... I would have got him. But, um, yeah. But, um, yeah, there we go then. That is the championship. That's not too bad. Let's go see how the next race goes.
It's, it's still a, it's still a, a early stages, so it doesn't really matter what change. So right, let's go and, let's go and have, a, have a look at the construct. So Yamaha have doubled their lead once again with 100. Honda, like I said, have doubled their lead again with 80. Ducati are in third with 61. Aprilia have now moved up into fourth. Uh, with 23. Kawasaki have moved up as well. Uh, it's, it looks like it's now Suzuki though at the bottom of the grid now. So, so Kawasaki have moved up as well. And Suzuki have dropped down into 6th place. That's not bad by them. And Aprilia are in 4th. And there we go then. That's the end of that race. So that was actually not a bad one to be honest with you. That was actually not... That was actually not a bad one, to be fair. I know that, like I said, though, that Tony Ellis didn't do a, didn't do a bad one because since he ended in a, he ended in in, uh, in 20th. But apart from that, though, that has not been bad. And the next round is my favourite track, which is Lost Sail. That is the next round. So I'm going to go and just write this down on my on my notes. Right, let's just go and uh, just write, just write this down. So right, round number five will be la, 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 Kata. Okay. Okay. Is Qatar an A or is it an E? Oh, it's an A. Oh, I can see. There we go. Right, the next round will be Qatar, and th this is going to be th this is going to be really easy. I bet this one will be one of the easiest races. This one because I like Qatar. Qatar is one of my favourite circuits in the game. And one thing I know, by the way, that I will be starting from the back of the grid in the next episode. I didn't actually mention I will be starting from the back in the in the next episode. So I'm just going to stick with that. But apart from that, though, guys, that's the end of uh, of this week's AR crew. If you guys have enjoyed this AR crew, please give me a uh, thumbs up on this on this video. Uh, please go and subscribe to the channel if you are new around here. Don't forget, uh, we're on the road to 500 subscribers, and that'll be really appreciated. The 300 will be the Q&A. Uh, we're getting so close to 300. Uh, uh, I know, I know they're actually not that. Oh god, uh, I know they're actually not that uh, not that close at the um at the moment. But um, apart from that, though, it's it's absolutely fine. I'm, pr I'm pretty much alright with it, aren't I? I'm pretty much uh, alright with uh. With, 100, with 220 subscribers, I'm pretty, mu pretty much alright with that. But um, at least it will go down to a pretty much experience. So the next run we'll be on, guys, will be Qatar. So make sure you guys, uh, make sure you guys come and stick with that. It's going to be an interesting next race, actually, because Qatar is one of my favourite circuits, and hopefully that Tony Elias is not going to be a bit of a not going to be a bit of a stupid guy, and he's going to be up in the top ten because. At the moment, though, I'm getting a little bit worried about Tony Elias because if he finishes all the way down in 10th place, that's not good by him. Uh, so what I'm going to try and do, if Tony Elias finishes low down in the next race, I'm going to basically, I'm going to basically just finish above him. That's what that's what I'm going to do in the next race. Just finish above him, so I just don't finish him fourth. That's what I'm going to go and do in the next race. So yeah, that's gonna, that's got what we're going to do in the next episode. But that's the end of this one here for AR, AR Crew episode number 24. So there'll be a new AR Crew coming up next Thursday as always. So so don't go and stick for that from that way. But for now, I want to thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.